The Great Houdini Chain Escape. We have a chain, and it's very special because it has two rings on it. One ring at the end, we call it ring number one, and another ring a few inches away, that's ring number two. To start, you put the end of the chain through ring number one, and that makes a loop like this. And you put that loop over your wrist here. The important thing is that ring number one must be in line with your thumb and make sure it stays there if it slips the trick won't work so keep that in line like this you then give the spectator the padlock and you put your wrist together locking ring number one in place and you say can you put the end of the chain that's it perfect all the way around and put it through ring number two perfect and then pull it back again as tight as you can and put the padlock on the end of the chain and then padlock it as far around as you can, as tight as you can. That's perfect, so you can see the padlock is there completely locked in but of course you can escape at any time simply by putting your hands together and then putting your palms down and that loosens the chain so you can take your hands out as easily as that.